Hello everyone, Smoxie here from Celebrant Quest. Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. I am a registered civil marriage celebrant in Australia, which means that I love love, but I also love playing video games. And I honestly can't wait to get back into this one. Um, we are playing, uh, what am I, a bard. Uh, Dark Urge is the origin. Uh, and we're going through the Dank Crypt, so let's press on. Hmm, this door is locked. Watch your I did pick up a key. I was hoping that that would open that, but I'm going to get a Starion <laughs> to try to open this. Oh, I needed a 10. We're, we're fine. There we go. You were right, Astarian, as usual. That was easy. No one back home will ever believe this. Moving ahead. Okay. This place wasn't built for the living. No? Oh, there's another torch. Always room for more. Oh. No traps, please. Protection from good and evil. We didn't actually use that in the fight that was in the last room with Withers. Um, I am only playing on balanced, so that probably has something to do with it. Now, hang on a second. I've got a couple of options. There's this smaller door here. Let's try this small door first. Oh, where does this go? The refectory. Huh. Uh. Maybe I should get my torch out, actually. Oh, that's a little better. Now we can see. <laughs> All right. No lock, no handle. How does it open? No lock and no handle. <gasps> oh, sugar. Help! Something's coming out of the crypt. Oh, something's coming out of the crypt. That's so funny. Um. So there's just one enemy by the looks of it. Oh no, you're blocking the door. That means Astarian can't get through. I hate when that happens. Okay. Can we jump? Oh, we can. Hell yeah. And that hasn't even taken an action. Now, can we do this sneak attack? No, must have advantage. Damn. All right, let's get hurt. Astaria needs a 13, but he rolled a 7. I could use the potent dice to do a 14. Let's do let's do it because I don't really want her calling the rest in here. Okay. Oh my god, he only hit for five. Oh dearie me. Okay. Oh well. Them's the breaks, I guess. Can't even catch my breath. Um Should we try to hit her for 10? Then she can't move. Let's just try it. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Oh, it is. Great. I'd say that's probably a good idea. Because now we don't have to deal with the rest of the guys. So I could hear voices. I think it's coming through that door. There's an oil barrel as well. Not over. Okay. Oh, oh, that's a locked door too. What's this book of final breath? Better that will fit in my pack. What's Oops. on your mind? Sorry, Gail, hun, I didn't mean to talk to you, mate. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so which door should we open? Why don't we go with this door? We'll try this one first. Now, uh, I guess I theoretically want to have a melee character well, open the door. So let's go with a Starion to open the door. Okay, so there's the two dudes there. So can I... No, still can't do a sneaky. 
That's fine. Mm, I can get him with the melee weapons. Uh, let's move in closer. Not enough movement. Okay, sorry. Oh, no, Excellent. no, no. Just cancel. Time to push my luck again. Oh, you melleed the ground, man. I really need to learn my lesson with that, honestly. <laughs> oh, well, okay. Astarian just... Nothing will stand in was my was a bit way. terrible there. And that was totally my fault, mate, not yours. So... Coat your active weapon with a toxin. Huh. That could be cool. Mm. Oh my god. I know I should get over it, but I can't get over how cool this is with the violin. We're going to inspire Lazel. Yeah, I reckon. Let's move a little closer in. Hmm. Yeah, let's move a little closer in. Forward. And then we're going to... Let's do something where we're going to make these guys a little bit more, I think, weak. Up to three creatures receive a minus D4 penalty. They're too far. Done. Okay, not that one then. That's fine. Vicious Mockery. Um, what does that do again? Disadvantage on the next attack roll. Let's go with this, uh, the, yeah, let's go with this guy. Be gone, hot face loon. Oh, saved. Done. <laughs> All right, let's end our turn. Clear off. We got here first. Oh, they did explode that barrel. Oh, Gale's arm is dead. Man, Gale is so weak. Um, instead of casting the mage armor, I kind of just want to get rid of dudes. Let's just go one, two, three on this guy. What did that do? A little bit. And Gale, just hide in the corner here, sweet pea. You're a bit useless sometimes, mate. Uh, okay, so Lazel, my darling. Um, let's get her to dash because I want her to move to strike this guy, I guess. Hmm. Was that a silly idea? No, I don't think it was a silly idea. Let's put her here. On the move. Oh, I can get this guy standing right here. I forgot about him and I literally just engaged. Oh, I can't. Yes, I can. Here we go. Oh, a crit, baby. Nice one, man. Can I get the pommel strike onto this guy? Oh, I can. Oh, yes, that's awesome. All right. Um. I might stay here so I'm kind of blocking his path through. That might be a good idea. And we've got a, what, a wizard here. And another archer. Oh, nice one. So he can rage and attack even though he's dazed. So it's not meaning that he's like knocked out or anything. Alrighty, can we? Oh, not enough movement. Are you freaking kidding me? That's disappointing. What about this one? Oh, we can get her. Let's get her. Make it hurt. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Can I reach this guy? No. Still can't target any of those. I need to be way closer. I could move in. Could I theoretically move in and do both of those guys? Let's see. These boots have seen everything. 
target is out of sight. All right, that's no good either. Okay, that's fine. Lessons learned. Let's hit with the arrow. Nice one, man. What's this one? A flourish. Okay, I need to be closer. Mm. Creator, destroyer. Gail, my darling, I really don't think you're destroying anything, sir. Uh, let's take out Torga. Dance macabre. Nice one, dude. Very nice, sweetie. All right, you can rest up. Here she goes. Oh, that was good. May as well heal ourselves. Beautiful. Oh, did he slip? I think he did. Yeah, he did. That's great. Starion, uh, leave that one to Lazel. Come and do this guy. Sounds like fun. You missed? Nah, don't react. You're okay. Oh, go on, dude. The unclaimed. Okay, we've got a couple of things to loot in here. Where do I go from here? Oh, well, you can shoot this guy if you like. Time for some bloody work. For three. Nice one. What fools these mortals be. Um. Why don't you just hit them with a fire spell? Oh. All good. Come on, Lazel. There we go. Oh, it's a javelin. Nice. Okay. That was very good. I, um, we did very well. Okay, got this guy. Oh no! Open up. We've already looted him. I <laughs> put my hands on everything. I am not reading all of that. Don't waste. Here's a plaque. You do not recognize the language on the plaque. Hmm. Does Gale? Let me work my magic. Yes, please. You do not no, recognize okay. the language on the planet. That's fine. Chapel records. Drowning. Internal rot. Fever. Very well. Oh, here's another one. That's curious. A lever. I wonder, what that did. I wonder too. All right. The unclaimed. Did I? Let's see what this does. I can't even remember if I read that. Oh yeah, I did. Duh. <laughs> Let's go. All right. So that door's locked. This door's not locked. Ooh, a chest. Wait, I need that torch on again, dude. That's a bit better, isn't it? You know what we need to do? We need to get to the town so that we can actually sell some things. I feel like my characters have just got like just so many like items in their bags and just haven't you know just haven't made any money yet. All right, Astarian, can you do this one? Or do I actually have the key for this one? Oh, there's a lever. <laughs> All right. What now? Best be Let's see. Oh, there's a baddie. Oh, it's Lazelle's turn. Can you get through, dear? You can. No time to All right, let's see if we can whack him from here. Nope. Damn. 
Nope. Could dash. Let's go dash up here. Okay. Mm, let's dash on Astarian as well. A better position. I was gonna say, surely, uh, Oh, let's let's roll. He rolled a one. That's funny. Over here. We got I was thinking we may as well roll because we will be uh, resting quite soon. Let's do a piercing shot. Oh, he's got a gaping wound. That sounds bad. <laughs> that sounds really bad. Mate, the violin is definitely the best instrument. One can't always be a gentleman. I, I just love Gail. On the double. Oh, you missed, mate. Dude. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Oh, well. No, actually, it's all right. <laughs> I meant to hit her with the sword. Whoa. Whoa, mate. Are you okay? Oh, my lord. <laughs> Dude, for half a second, that was hilarious. Alrighty, what we got? Anything of use? Ooh. We have a lot here. I've already done that one. Sausage, oh, cheese, everything. I'm so tired. How do people do this all day? Don't worry, darling, we're about to rest. Cheese wheels. Such a Impressive silence. Must be lonesome to be a forgotten god. One day I'll catch a break. What else have we got? <laughs> I'm sorry, the way that guy felt was just so funny. Alright, so are we basically done with Let's these ruins see. now? Ancient, indecipherable text covers the plaque. No! A dead tongue. Whoever worshipped here must be long There gone. was that um, locked door, wasn't there? Oh, hang on. Is this door open or? Oh, so we're back here. Okay, let's go back in. Because there was that, uh, I think there was a big door that we hadn't opened yet. Uh, where was it? Or am I completely just making that, making that up? Have I lost my mind? I mean, it's entirely possible. Um, no, wait a sec. Wait a sec. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so that chapel is with the lever. Alright, this door had nothing. I thought there was a big door that we hadn't opened yet, but I'm clearly... Maybe it's through here again. Ah, oh, a heavy oak door. Is that the one? It must be. Yeah, I knew there was another door. Aha! Benches, etc. Oh. Oh. Traps. Oh, traps. All right, Astarian, you're up, mate. Oh, a ten. <gasps> Luck. All right, cool. Oh, there's a plaque there too. 
text on the plaque is a mystery to you. God, they're always mysteries to me. Ooh, another trap. Oh, there's more traps. The hell? We've only got two disarm trap kits. Oh dear. Left a trap so we best not um, ruin this. Critical success. Nice one, dude. You've rolled a 20 on this skill check. A critical success and have automatically passed it. Hell yeah. Ooh. Didn't mean to do that. Gosh, this yes, game is so yes. pretty. Okay, so there's more there we can loot. Did I see another one? Someone doesn't like visitors. Wait, that's another trap. Gosh, Astarian's just like a button. Huh? Oh, the button is over there. Wait, is this a trap or no? Maybe not. Oh, it is. We just hadn't discovered it yet, I guess. All right. Oh God, is there another trap around? An arrow and we've got uh, some trap kit that's good okay so we can I'll just help go myself. through that door in a sec oh there are traps about. Oh, there's heaps of traps in this room how many is that gotta be about eight Another one? Oh, oh dear. Someone's left a trap. This episode is just called Traps. <laughs> oh, God, there's something else we haven't perceived. I've got to say, Starry, you're doing very well. Oh, here's another one. Someone doesn't like visitors. Hello? Hello? <laughs> okay, we can't get... I can't reach? Uh, what's that one's done? There's that button. I hesitant. I hesitate to press it. Turn-based mode. You've entered turn-based mode. The game has paused around you. Why? To oh, can be used to avoid traps, perils, or being spotted. Why would I need turn-based mode? Are we? What is that? Three point five meters. What is that thing? Do I attack it? No, <laughs> no. Uh, exit turn based mode? How about that? Oh, sugar. Oh, sugar. <laughs> oh, my God, Astarian. Um, oh, sugar. Go, go, go. <laughs> can, you, can you please? Oh no! Oh my God! Well met. I am a magical projection of Gale. Of oh my God! If you see this manifestation, that means I have prematurely perished. However, <laughs> for reasons that cannot be disclosed, it is of vital importance that my death be remedied at your earliest convenience. Yeah, I would hope so. <laughs> you may rest assured that I do not speak out of self-preservation alone. Many lives depend on my return to the living 
within the span of two days. Two days? I trust I've made myself clear. Oh my god, how am I supposed to bring you back to life? Why do many lives depend on your return to the living? I'm starting to think you'd be better off dead! That's just mean, man. I love my man, Gail. Um... I'm supposed to bring you back to life. Uh, maybe number one. I have upon my deceased person a magical item that can accomplish my return. But such is the value and rarity that it is protected by a multi layered security protocol. Okay. I will now explain the protocol. Okay. Step one is to retrieve from my person a pouch I wear over my heart. Weird, but okay. Next, you must unthread the purple seam that seals it in a counterclockwise fashion. Do not touch any other colored strand. Okay. Inside the pouch, you will find a folded letter and a tiny flute. Unfold the letter and note the markings in the top and bottom corners. These are the notes you will need to play. Starting from the bottom right, play the notes in correct order, clockwise this time. Upon completion of the tune, a magma method will appear, which will pose the following question. <laughs> Iskcha Chisnaga. This is Ignan for what is my name? The answer is Kasitrak Ash. Pronounce the name correctly and the method will breathe on the letter. Stay clear because the little scamp can melt metal. Dude. <laughs> Words will now appear on the letter's surface, effectively turning the letter into a scroll of true resurrection. Use it to bring me back to life. Oh my god. <laughs> Fine, I'll do it. Uh, I, I promise I will do so. This is all ridiculously elaborate. A scroll of true resurrection. That sounds valuable. I think we should go with that sounds valuable. See what he says. So it is. Our lives depend on it. Now, repeat my instructions back to me, please. N um, no freaking way, man. Uh, come again? I got it. Seems, notes, names, the lot. Are you kidding me? Absolutely not. I'm gonna go with that. Are you kidding me? Absolutely not. I'm not trying to try your patience. I simply need to be absolutely certain you understand. Oh, I understand, all right. <laughs> oh god, fine. I'll play along. Step one, retrieve the pouch. Forget it. I'm going to resurrect you now, if that's all right with you. Unsummon yourself, Gail, before I find a way to kill you twice. <laughs> <laughs> um no I want Tim in my party I would love to do number three but I'm so worried that he'll just vanish for good so let's say forget it I'm going to resurrect you now have it your way I can only hope your memory stretches further than your patience best of luck with the protocol may my cold dead hands soon be refilled with the warmth of life so they can shake yours in gratitude mm -hmm. <laughs> all right um this is my thing <laughs> how do i get them oh because that seems to keep happening um hmm <laughs> Jeez. Is that just going to keep happening? So it's only that one. No, we can do this. Oh my god. Keep a really close. Can I go to turn based mode? Can I get you to resurrect him out of line of sight? Oh, you can't move? Come closer, Starin. Resurrect him. Thank you. I cannot die. Please. Oh, me. sugar. How are we supposed to do this? Um. I actually don't know how we're going to do this. 
No, you know what? I can work this out. It's all good. Let's go to Lazel. Let's risk the fire. Yep. She's coming back out of the fire. No, she's not. She's staying in the fire. Okay, you're going to chug that potion. You're going to use your scroll. No, you can't use your scroll. Fantastic. Um, come this way. End your turn. Oh my god, that's so good. It missed her. Alright, Gail, I need you to uh, resurrect her. Fantastic. Move out the way. Starion, come back over here. Lizelle, you're coming back here too. And no, never mind. Can we risk trying to loot this? Screw it. Let's try to loot it. Watcher's guide and engraved key. What's that? A spear. That's it, bud. These boots have seen everything. Good job, mate. And let's end the turn base mode. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. <laughs> Alright, Gail, tell me what's up, bro. My word, you did it. <laughs> oh, it's good to be alive. My hands are still cold, so that handshake will have Actually, to wait. Actually, Lazelle the and Starion did it. Thank you. You're welcome and welcome back. It's time for explanation, Gail. Let's do it's time for explanation. Yes. I was afraid you'd say that. Mm -hmm. Only fair to warn you I have precious few answers to spare. I apologize if that sounds thankless. It's just that some secrets simply cannot be revealed. I brought you back to life. A few answers is the least you can spare me. I will have answers or I will put you in the ground to myself. You know what? It's fine. You will tell me when you're ready. Um, I don't want him to get so annoyed with us that he leaves. So let's do the I brought you back to life. A few answers is the least you can spare me. Oh, nice one. I suppose that after all you've done for me, I should be at least a little bit forthcoming. Just a little. Tell you what, I will answer one question that you may have, to the best of my ability, if I can. I simply want to know what it is you're keeping from me. Why did your projection say that many lives depend on your resurrection? Actually, never mind. If it makes you this uncomfortable, I won't insist. Um... Let's ask about why the projection said many lives depend on his resurrection. Because it was the truth. The truth is a great motivator. I am dangerous. Not because I want to be, but because of an error I made in the past. It makes me dangerous, even in death. Hmm. You brought me back to life, and for that, I am in your debt. I was surrounded by danger. It could happen again. If it does, bring me back again. You must, for the sake of many. I will try, my dearest. I will try. All right. If we go turn-based, can we nip around and get out the door here? Let's see. We can, man. The clock sound and everything is just so freaking cool. Let's go. Charmed, I'm sure. Probably should have used the dashes. Oh, yeah, I might do, actually. Where are you going, Gales? Here we go. Nasty surprise. Oh, now you perceive it, Gail. <laughs> Let's be quick. 
Why are you going that way? Is she in the way? Might be. Mm -hmm. Can we an efficient path. Jump or yeah, there we go. Oh, there's grease there. Alas, time for chatter. Never mind. All right, let's exit turn base mode now. Oh no 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 no! Oh you idiot! Go out the door! Out the door! <laughs> <laughs> wait where is wait where the hell is gail oh my god where is gail you're absolutely joking oh my god <laughs> oh gosh here we go, Astarian. Oh, what is happening? Get out, everybody. Oh my god, you were out of a party and now you're back in a party. I want you out of the party, okay? Please. Oh my god. Because now I've got to go and bloody get G Gail. Okay, this is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> um, does anyone have a resurrection scroll on them? No time to rest. You do, okay. Now you go we're going separate separate party please. <laughs> Alright, look, hold on. Oh shit a brick, are you joking? Get up. <gasps> Okay. We've saved me. Take my yeah, all right, mate. Oh, man. Let's go. All right. Get out the goddamn freaking place, please. Quite ready for you. Not enough movement. Are you joking? Of course. Let's go. Oh my god. That, <laughs> that was ridiculous. That was ridiculous. All right, everybody, we are exiting turn mode and we're going to camp now. <laughs> Please don't die. Okay, everybody, in your beds. <laughs> Oh my god, what is Gail doing? Let's go talk to Gail. doing neat trick all that wizardry makes me uncomfortable all that wizardry makes me uncomfortable let's go whatever for look at him never too much of a good thing i say well that's true be that as it may ceramorphosis what does it make you think of Baldur's gate three <laughs> first and foremost that damn tadpole until quite recently nothing at all if you're about to start a lecture, I'm not interested. Hmm. <laughs> We're a bard, though, so we do like a bit of a story. Um, I'm going to say the tadpole. Spot on. Day one, fever and memory loss. Day two, hallucinations and graying skin. Day three, hair loss and blood leaking from all orifices. Need to go on? 
Um, yeah. <laughs> Day four, excruciating pain as the skeleton and organs reform and reposition. Day five, the host personality has disappeared. Fingers and toes and limbs elongate. Yuck. I take it you get the picture? I do, but <laughs> you might as well finish the picture. <laughs> Day six, the flesh around the mouth splits to make way for tentacles. Day seven, a mind flayer is born. A very, vi very vivid picture and very upsetting. We should be having a fever by now, graying skin even. Just wrap this up, will you? Let's do number three. My point is this. Our orifices remain blissfully unblooded, our heads remain clear, and our blood temperature normal. Any expert will agree this is abnormal. Long live the abnormal. Can you explain why the symptoms aren't showing? And what makes you the expert? I say long live the abnormal. I'll toast to that. The pragmatic in me, however, sees only the silence before the storm. Okay. Something to sleep on. We should get some rest. Oh my god, Gail, you tell me a horror story before bedtime and then say, off you go. <sighs> Let's see what Mr. Astarian has to say. I need a quick word. Oh, he's... Wait! Wait, 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 wait. What is that? <gasps> Hello? Signs are showing. Oh, my God. Same here? Is that blood too? Oh, no, that's a shadow. That's a shadow. Smugs, don't get excited. I saw you getting a lecture from our magical friend. I have to say, I thought you'd look worse, but no, not a tentacle to be seen. That's what everyone's saying. It's so strange. Or is it so strange? I'm hoping I'll stay that way. Not yet. I could say the same to you. I could say the same to you. Indeed you could. We're all doing surprisingly well, given the circumstances. I'm not taking anything for granted, of course. First sign of change, and I'll have to stop that pretty little heart of yours. <laughs> I am open to suggestions. Knives, poison, strangulation, whatever you'd prefer. Oh. <laughs> Don't make me choose. There are too many good options. <laughs> I'd prefer not to die. A knife. That seems quick. Poison. That sounds painless. Ooh. Uh, try it and I'll spill your guts. I'm not sure. How would you like to go? Um, I want the so many good options. Well, that's a little dramatic, don't you think? <laughs> Come on, humor me. If you had to choose. If I had to choose, I'd want the knife. Make it quick. Poison, then. It should be painless, at least. I don't have to choose. I'd rather have one of the others do it. Oh no, I'd rather Astarian do it, for sure. Um. Um. Oh my gosh. Let's just uh, go the knife. <laughs> A classic. One good thrust to the heart and you're gone. We need a good blade, of course. Don't want to waste time hacking and prodding with a dinner knife. Uh, <laughs> well, I'm getting ahead of myself. <laughs> this is all a worst case scenario. Obviously. Obviously. <laughs> he hasn't thought about it at all. <laughs> Obviously, but that won't happen. It can't. And you? How should I kill you? Oh, yes. How should I kill you? <laughs> oh, my dear. I'd like to see you try. Now, let's get some rest. The sooner we start tomorrow, the better our chances of keeping this hypothetical. <laughs> oh, amazing. All right, let's sleep. Here we go. Ah, oh, here he is, skulking around. Oh. Hey. 
Hey! Withers, mate, hello. Oh, this is a pretty boat. Did you come in on the boat, Rhythms? I have no idea. We meet again. Are you okay, mate? Oh, he's <laughs> had his eyes closed. <laughs> I shall be here in thy camp for whenever thou hast need of my services. Okay. Not to be rude, but what are you? There are many answers to that question. None are important. Oh, aren't they? <laughs> Skeletons aren't supposed to be able to talk. If you won't answer, then get out of my camp. Let's do skeletons. Correct. <laughs> uh, okay. Are you going to explain further? No. Oh my god. Does Withers hate me or something? What kind of services can a skeleton offer? A mending of the threads between life and death. Should thou or any of thy compatriots perish, I will cleave soul to body once more. Wait. So I, I wasted all those scrolls? <laughs> uh, that's incredibly powerful magic. Why is it so easy for you? You mentioned a cost. What is it? And you look very ugly doing it. Oh, that's so funny. Helpful. No one's dead on my side at the moment, though. Oh, my God. I don't want to fully insult him because if he can do that, I want him to stay. Uh... <laughs> No, I want to, and look very ugly doing it. Amusing. <laughs> he didn't like that. <laughs> because it is my calling, there is little else to explain. Okay. Wow. Can you help me change my class? All right, you mentioned a cost. What is it? A matter... Of coin. So it's only 200. Oh, that's outrageous. <laughs> um. Such is life. Outrage leading to a singular end. Okay, well. Let me change my class. Huh. Withers. This strange wraith commends many powers. He allows you to resurrect allies, hire help, and change your class for a price, of course. Well, that's really cool, man. Okay, welcome, Withers. Um, let's have a chat to Astarian before we leave. Look at this blood everywhere, man. You have a manner of... Irresistible desperation about Do you. I? I like Do it. Do you? Oh. Okay. <laughs> we should have a little buff that says Astarian said one nice thing to me one time. <laughs> but it was a backhanded compliment. <laughs> Go ahead. I'm listening. That protocol of yours, what makes it so... Why make it so difficult? The instructions were easy enough, weren't they? They're slightly elaborate. Like I said, I'm dangerous even in death. I'm merely trying to protect those around me. Mm -hmm. I find that a healthy amount of theatrics, a voice from the beyond, a magic flute, a friendly, if highly combustible, magma method tends to make for a more compelling case. If nothing else, I'm sure I piqued your curiosity. Absolutely. All right. <laughs> oh, gosh. All right. Let's leave camp. Let's get back on the road, folks. Okay, so we're done with that ruin. Let's head to... Did I miss anything down here? I don't know. Basically, it's just straight ahead of us. Uh, let's see. No, because this is where we took 
We took on those guys. Oh shit, what happened? <laughs> Honestly. Oh look, here we go. Mate, we're like fire prone. What else have we got? Anything good? More Some mergrass. Belladonna. Hmm. Wooden trunk. Now I saw something that you can... Oh, just like that. <laughs> you can hit boxes and stuff so I guess we don't need to rely on a starion all the time all right so where are we now all right so we can't get anywhere here so we need to I'm gonna fast travel roadside cliffs uh let's head up here Okay, that's where Lazel was. Let's go this way. Where, the f where are you guys? Oh, there you are. <laughs> you just took a little while to get up here, hey? Um, let's go this way. Oh, that's where Lazel was, right. I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? Oh, a snare trap. Broken. Must have been here a while. I hear shouting up ahead. Music to give Yankee ears. <laughs> oh, waypoint discovered. All right, let's go see what this shouting is about. What's up here? Oh, this is the grove, is it? Open the bloody gate! Nobody gets in! Sevlor's orders! That pack of goblins will be on us any second! We'll have to listen What's to Daddy on? Zevlo. Goblins are on our tail. Oh, there he is, Open Daddy. The gate, <laughs> you let goblins here? Where is the druid? Please, there's no time. Uh oh. By the nine hells! Open the gates! <clears throat> The gates open the gate. Bit too much Elden Ring. <laughs> Get him. No. Oh my god, dudes. I can't believe they try to hold that gate, honestly. But luckily they all didn't lose their hands, honestly. Form a line. I love how they say form a line and they run off without her. Provoke the blade and suffer its sting. Oh, baby. All right. Blow the horn, Daddy. Alrighty, what are we gonna do? Lazelle, maybe start by healing yourself. Oh, mate, you got 11? That's sick. Oh, look who's here. There's a little goblin here. Oh, there's no goblin there anymore. <laughs> um, I wonder if I can make this. Let's do another action. 
Let's go get this guy. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Doesn't matter, does it? Oh, Lazelle, lay in the smackdown, baby girl. All right, let's see. Nope, turn over. Ooh, what's that grease? And who have we got? A Starian. Uh, hmm. Let's do this guy over here. I wonder if I can just shoot him. Do I get any kind of sneak attack on him? No. It's worth the question every time. With pleasure. What'd you hit for six? Um, can you hop down? Keep guessing. Beautiful. So much for peace. Alrighty, let's put a piercing shot on someone. Can we reach? Hmm. Let's do a piercing shot on that one. Oh my god. Okay, gaping wind. So he's gonna bleed, so that's good. Let's move to the edge here and we can sort of do our healy thing, etc. I'm going to inspire a Starian, I think. Let's see how he goes. By sickle and sword. Nice. Oh. That grease looks gross. rallied anymore she lost all the extra HP okay Gail what are you going to do no 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 <laughs> sorry mate <laughs> if I set that on fire that's gonna ignite those three I think though so why don't we instead It's like a lot of them there. Let's try this. That hits both of those, I think, what that's telling me. Does that hit both of them? Mm. Let's try the boss. Sorry, Ar Aradin, you might get hit. No, I don't know if that was good, bad or nothing, to be honest. Oh, I forgot about that guy over there. So he's taken out. That's good. Ooh, nice one, man. Mm. Ooh. Okay, Lazel. Why don't we go down and say hello to this goblin brawler? And then that will free up Astarian. Oh, you missed, babe? Oh my gosh. Uh. Oh, not on the crit you didn't, dude. Let's go. Oh, a crit miss. Nice. Yeah, you can reach him. Let's go. Oh, you missed on the last one, mate. All right, that's fine. This is worth the cost. Target is too far. Gosh, I really need to be a lot closer for that. Let's see if we can get this bugbear done. Hit for 10, that's pretty good. Might as well heal myself. 
Beautiful. Alright, gosh, I'm loving this bird. You missed again? Holy hell. Will, what are you doing? Oh. He's frightened, so he can't move. Um, let's do one on him. I'll leave that one to Astarian. And two on that guy. Nice. just the bus now. Let's get in there, Lazo. Ooh. What if I can move here and push him into the grease? Does that work? Nice, man. Alright, Astarian, why don't you just shoot him from there? Nice. That was the last of them. Inside! All of you! More may follow! Open the gate! Oh, a javelin. Another step forward. Hmm. Mm. What's that? I'll go and have a look at that in a sec. Something good here, I hope. Oh, we've all leveled up too, that's awesome. Anyone else? Bath. Okay, that is stealing, I know that one. So we're not gonna steal from Bath. What did we just pick up there? Gloves of power, absolute bane. On a hit with a weapon attack, possibly inflict a 1d4 penalty to the attacks, uh, sorry, the target's attack rolls and saving throws. Oh, a minus 1d4. Sleight of hand plus one. That sounds like an Astarian set of gloves. Careful, I might. I hope so. So let's put that there. Yes. Uh, what have you got? I crave nope. blood. All right, mate. Because she's so intense, dude. All right, what's this? The Watcher's Guide. Death's Promise. When the spear misses its target, the wielder's next attack roll against that set uh, that target gains true strike. What's true strike? The spellcaster has advantage on attack rolls against this creature. Huh. Okay. Oh my god, do I still have my torch attached? I mean, uh, what? Maybe my bard can have this one. Let's try it. She got a spear. That sounds good. We've also got this hat. Dexterity saving throw. That's an Astarian Trust one as one. well, perhaps. Trust no one. That sounds like... Uh... Oh, what am I thinking? I think it's World of Warcraft I've just got a flashback to. <laughs> yeah. Undead, I think. A shield. Now, I think... Can I, my bard equip a shield? No one stopped me yet. Let's see. She can. Does that work? That kind of works. Armor class 15. I think that's good. What does this hat do? A frumpy hat. 
spiked shield. Oh, I guess that's much of a muchness. I didn't realize I had that. Um, wait. Oh my god, it does zero to five damage. Why am I equipping that? Can't do that one, can't do that one. What did I have before? That one. Well, that was lucky. All right. That's right, I was gonna uh, see what's over here. Can't get there. Let's jump. Oh my god, hurry up. <laughs> oh, and we've got to level up too. this guy hmm? okay nothing down there then what about over here oh some balsam <gasps> and mushroom I'll take that good one What's over here? Nothing. Okay. It's got this ladder. <coughs> Who is making that noise? <coughs> Let's have a look. Heavy chest. <coughs> ring it's no use <laughs> what's that an oil barrel I'm encumbered I'm carrying too much oh my gosh oh guidance I think Shadow Heart had that one why were they here why indeed, Gail? Why, why, why? Um. Let's... wonder if I can, like, send... Like, can I press shift or something and it... Oh my god, it does. Uh, just send to, like, Lazelle or something, eh? Let's level this up. All right, bad level three. I've got cutting words. Use your wit to distract a creature and sap its confidence. Oh, I like. Wait, what? What am I? Oh. College of Law, College of Valor, College of Swords. Fighting style. Slushing Flourish. Uh, no, I didn't want to be a fighty fight person. College of Valor, Combat Inspiration. Inspire an ally to add a one, a plus one D6 bonus to their next attack roll ability check saving through weapon damage or armor class last until long rest college of law <clears throat> you pursue beauty and truth collecting knowledge from scholarly tomes to peasants tales and use your gifts to avoid both audience to hold both audiences and enemies spellbound i think that sounds better let's do that yep done and we've got to do our spells. Is that what it's saying? Skills. No. Deception and performance. Fine. 
What do you want? Three out of these. You will receive a bonus to every skill that you are proficient in. This bonus increases as, your, as you gain levels in your class and applies to all checks for that skill. So what would I want it in though? What does insight do? Read people and situation, detect lies. Oh, what was it in? Deception. Proficiencies, deception, performance. Um, all right, that's fine. So I want these ones, I guess. Perception, observe your environment. Um, I don't really care. I don't think about that. Athletics. No, I've got no strength anyway, so why would I do that? Acrobatics. Keep your balance. Land on your feet. Dexterity. I mean, I could do that, couldn't I? Is that how this works? I don't know. <laughs> Sleight of hand. Wield nimble fingers, fingers and steal stuff. Well, that's not me. Stealth, I don't need. Arcana. Recognize magic. Interact with enhan enchanted items. Okay. What does that do? Mm -hmm. History. Remember the past. Investigation. Analyze clues. Solve mysteries. Nature. Religion. Um, I like the religion aspect. Acrobatics. Stay on my feet. Why did I want that one? I think it's because, like, if someone throws grease or whatever at us. Uh, history, investigation, nature, perception. We could spot hidden details. Um. No, let's go acrobatics. Why not? Beautiful. And then a spell. Okay. Choose the spell you know uh, from the list below. Spells require spell slots. Okay. So these are spell twos and these are spell ones, I'm thinking. Yep. Level one spell slot. Level two. Okay. What have we got? Blindness, calm emotions, cloud of daggers, crown of madness. Oh, okay. Detect thoughts. Enhance ability. Bestow a magical enhancement upon an ally. They gain advantage on ability checks with the chosen ability. <clears throat> In throw, reduce a creature's peripheral vision and make it look at you. Heat metal. Okay. Hold person. Invisibility, knock, lesser restoration, cure a creature from disease, poison, paralysis, or blindness. Hmm. Oh, shatter. Damage all nearby creatures and objects. Creatures made of inorganic materials, such as stone, have disadvantage. A silence. Um, I'm gonna go with the restoration, like the poison. Why not? Wait. Disease, poison, paralysis, or blindness. So when Gail gets like a bit hurt on the battlefield, we can like cure his seals. All right, fighter. Do I have to do this? Battle master, eldritch knight, or a champion? Improve critical hit? Ooh. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. You're a warrior of spell and sword. No, we've got enough spells going on with Gale missing all of his. As a paragon of tactical superiority, you employ a wide array of combat maneuvers to dominate every fight. Your superiority dice are eight Ds, D8, sorry. You have four. You have four. Okay. A fighter level 10. A fighter level 10, these dice become D10s. Alrighty. 
They fuel your battle master maneuvers and are expanded upon use. Expanded. You regain expended superiority dice after a short rest or long rest. Um, yeah, right. Battle master sounds good. Our maneuvers. A disarming attack? Um, I don't really want to disarm. I just want to like pew pew, don't I? So what's a sweeping attack? Swing your weapon in a rapid sweeping arc to attack multiple enemies at once. Okay, that could be good. Repost. When a hostile creature misses you with a melee attack, expend a superiority die to retaliate. Ooh. And rally. Expend a superiority die to gain uh, to grant an ally eight temporary hit points. Uh, pushing precision. You can spend a die to add it to the result of an attack roll. Menacing. To make it uh, an attack that deals an additional damage and possibly frightens the target. Attack that details additional damage on hit. Select which friendly creature will gain half its movement speed. It will not provoke attacks of opportunity. Fainting attack. Evasive footwork. You can evade attacks by imposing disadvantage. Um... Possibly knock the target prone. The target must be large or smaller. I'm gonna do that. Alrighty, so. I know that I don't want him to be an arcane trickster because that's the one with spells. I want him to be assassin, dealing sublime punishment to a single foe at a time. Not in a jewel mind because a jewel implies chivalry and you're too busy getting the job done for honor. So you are a deadliest against unprepared enemies. In combat, you have advantage on attack rolls against creatures that haven't taken a turn yet, which is great because the Starion usually goes first. That's if you can reach them. <laughs> Any successful attack roll against a surprise creature is a critical hit. Assassin's Alacrity, quick as an alley cat in a rainy dark city. A rain duck city you immediately restore your action and bonus action at the start of combat i like yep let's do it and gale of water deep all right spells mate Okay, and not close the door and can. Okay, I like this one. Cloud of daggers. Contra cloud of daggers. That's for ten turns. Why not? Phantasmal force. Steel. Damage to a creature each turn. The type of damage changes to the last type the creature suffered. That's interesting. Mirror image. Create three illusionary duplicates of yourself that distract attackers. Each duplicate increases your armor class by three? Oh, hell yeah. Alrighty. What's here? What's ah, that? what is that? At the back of the crevice lies a bag enfolded in the chitinous squabbling of spiders. A shiny gold coin pokes from its mouth. Ew. <laughs> Nature, survey the spiders. All right, we just need a 10, come on. 
Ooh, good one. A critical success. The creatures nice. Clutch the pouch possessively. You have no doubt. A spider egg is nestled within. Ooh. All right, Bard, soothe the spiders with a calming lullaby. Oh, that sounds nice. Sleight of hand. Dart your hand in, hoping to snatch the bag. Well, I probably would get this one, but I want to see what the one bad one does. One, the spiders retreat to the rear of the Aww. crevice, lulled by your murmurs. Well, that's nice. You stash the bag. Something clinks Ooh. among the coins. Huh, what was it? A spider egg sack and gold. Nice. So is that bag just there all the time now? Very cool. All right. Now we need to go and make our way to the hollow over here, don't we? Whatever it's called. The grove. Let's go. Come on, intrepid explorers. Oh, there's a balsam. Hang on. Let's not be too hasty. <laughs> Good job. All right. Now we go. Nice. All right. Let's go. Oh, there's a guy still here that's not. Oh, should we? Yes. <laughs> yes, we shall. Oh, you know what I just realized? We have this. What does this do? Speak with dead. Let's talk to this dude. The corpse does not respond. Oh. Pfft. Well, that was a waste. Uh, okay. Uh, complete waste of time. All right, let's see what's up here. We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too? Unbelievable! Well, there's one goblin. There's ten. I'm leaving before the horde shows up. One fight just ended, and now you're picking another? Relax. Druid, those goblins didn't take any prisoners. You can cough up my payment any time now. Oh, a bard persuasion. What's unbelievable is how we beat the goblins. You're both heroes. Um, all right, let's try it. Come on, yes. <laughs> and who the hell are you again? Show some respect. <laughs> Excuse me. This woman saved your pathetic life. Well, I didn't ask for any goddamn help. Please, you were begging Look at me this to king. open the gate. Anything to save yourself, you coward. The human's eye twitches. He's about to blow. Oh, I could take a swing at the tiefling. Aim a blow at the human. If you want me to take both of you down, I will otherwise knock it off. That's a good one. More violence won't bring back those you lost. Stop and think. Uh, let's do the if you want me to bring uh, take both of you down, I will. Come on. Enough. Right, here we Swabbling go. Squabbling is pointless. The goblins have found us. At least we agree on that. More goblin vermin could be on their way. Our lady All right, well, maybe I'll leave this episode here before we get into the grove, because there's quite a bit to do in the grove, actually, isn't there? All right, well, thank you so much for joining me in Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, my name is Smox from Celebrant Quest. I'm having an absolute ball playing this. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel. 
Let me know also if I'm doing anything wrong because I bet that I am. And uh, I will see you in the next episode. All right. Be good, everyone. Bye-bye.